Hello again, welcome back to the channel. Here's your Series 2 recap. I did one jumbo box and one regular hobby box. And a lot of people don't want to watch like an hour and a half of shenanigans and nonsense, and I don't blame them. So I'll go through the best of it and do a little quick little announcement. This is a wrapper for a jumbo pack. And here is your pack odds. Uh, you're looking at gold one in six. And the platinum, I think, was one in 135,000. Uh, someone, they, someone, and then here's your pack odds for the uh, regular hobby. And it is gold one in 17 packs. And platinum one in 425,000. Uh, but you guys can check it out. As you can tell, the font is just like, I don't know, six point font, maybe maybe worse, possibly worse. Uh, but yeah, I think what you do is you take a platinum and then you calculate that like all three hundred thirty cards have a one of one, and then you figure it out math wise. Someone pointed out that it's possible that uh, they printed half of series two that they did of series one, um, which would be nice because the odds are better to pull parallels. But goodness gracious, checklist ain't great. Let me go over the recap really quickly. Uh, this is not everything, everything, but this is kind of like the the cream of the crop, so to speak. I'm sorry about my cord. Just get it in there. So uh, we do have a Dane Dunning, Mother's Day Pink. It is numbered 13 out of 50. 13 out of 50. You have a Michael Brantley autograph. No numbering there, but there you can see it. Michael Brantley autograph. We have a Silver Pack autograph of one Sunny Gray, and that one is numbered 5 out of 30. 5 out of 30. So that was a cool one. I got an Austin Riley. Blue parallel from a silver pack. That is numbered 78 out of 150. We have the TJ Ferriedel. Just base card autograph there. This is a short print of Marcus Simeon. And the code is, I think it's 965, I believe. It is so small. Um, I know I sound like an old man. Get off my lawn! But uh, yeah, it's so small. But short print. This is also, I believe, a short print of Jose Siri rookie card. Um, and 965, I believe. I looked him up. He has like 100 or so at bats this year with like a 200 and something average. There's a Jose Siri. And then we have a Dustin Pedroia. He's a retiree. I think he's younger than me. And he's a retiree, but there's just uh, your normal relic. Uh, let me get to this. So I thought that there was like a Wander Franco rookie card with a rookie card logo, but I think that they changed it. And I think it's just this with uh, Bryce Harper. Hugging Wander Franco. There's no rookie card logo, and there's no uh, mention of the name Wander Franco. And so this does not count as a rookie card in my book. Um, and so unless I'm crazy, I did open one jumbo and one regular hobby box. I did not pull a regular Wander Franco rookie card. So this might be it. And if this is it, that is really disappointing because that, that makes the chase not so great. Uh, one of the jumbos, all the jumbos get one of these uh, all-star game commemorative patches. Uh, you can get them autographed. I did not get an autographed version, but there's a Carl Yastrzemski. And then I got a Ryan Velade rainbow foil rookie card. He may end up being good. I'm not quite sure. And then we got this uh, significant statistics, Trey Turner parallel, numbered 75 out of 75, eBay 101. Um, so those are, those are the hits. Uh, before you go, I do want to say I did create some cool team packs because I have a whole bunch of cards that I don't particularly need or collect anymore. And uh, here's examples of the team packs. By the way, none of these cards are in the team packs. None of these, I'm going to sell those on separately. But uh, the team packs are as follows. I made a video. I'll link to it in the comment section and the description of this particular video. There's still like 27 teams worth of packs available. Super cheap. It's like $15 for one pack, including shipping in the U.S. Uh, Canada's extra and USA and Canada only. Um, but yeah, $15 for one pack. It's three for 30 Five for 40, seven for 50. It's like a, just tons and tons of cards. But here's an example of uh, one of the packs. Here's the Yankee. Here's one of the Yankees packs. Uh, here's a DJ LeMay. He's fresh from Series 2. A Rainbow Foil, Gary Sanchez. There's a Jeter. That's an insert from Series 2. It's Steven Writings. Um, as you can tell, uh, lots of dupes were pulled. I feel like I got duped. No, just kidding. Uh, whenever you get duplicates, and it feels like you never end up with the duplicates of the players that you want. But anyway, that's one of your Yankees packs. I think there's two Yankees packs. And then, um, for example, here's one of the Atlanta Braves packs. Here was a gold 
um, from the, the hobby box. Gold from the hobby box. There's a Jock Peterson who is a jock in it over in San Francisco now. Um, there's a there's from Series 1, Christian Pache Blue. So I did combine Series 1 with Series 2 and some older stuff. Because um, that's just how I did it. But uh, feel free to check out my other video with all the pack sales. There's also some older stuff from like 20 years ago. Um, here's the generation. Now, insert a Bacuna. I pulled two of those. And there's an Austin Riley and a Soroka. But yeah, uh, take care. Thanks for watching. And uh, go live that dream, kids. One pack away from greatness.